Hey guys, this is Microwave Meltdown, episode one. I'm going to uh, take a $100 bill and I'm going to wrap it around a shotgun shell and I'm going to microwave it, see what happens. Maybe it blows up, maybe it melts, I have no fucking idea. But for the next video, I want you to comment below telling me what you want me to put in the microwave next, whether it be a bullet. A, another microwave, like a smaller microwave and a bigger microwave. Uh, you know, can of spray paint, doesn't matter. Tell me what to put in the microwave next, and I'll highlight your comment in the next video, and then I'll do it. It's that simple. That's good. Alright, so I drilled a hole in the microwave so I could aim a flashlight down there. The light up there is just too dim. I can't see anything whenever I close the door. So I put a mirror on the side of the microwave so I can aim a flashlight down mounted on the side of the microwave so the light will reflect inside. So now the camera will be able to see just fine. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's exactly exactly what I wanted. Excellent. Nice. The reason why I mounted the flashlight on the side of the microwave aiming down instead of just poking a hole through it and putting the flashlight in there is because I think that whenever I turn on the microwave it's going to ruin the flashlight and I really don't feel like uh, you know, buying a new flashlight each time I turn on the microwave. So this way you know, I'll save my flashlight and get the same results.
Well, there's the money. Well, that's cool. Oh, yes!